Hey guys, welcome to Speak About Digital. In this video, I'm going to guide you on how you can easily use Linktree. I'm going to cover a very quick basic tutorial to get you going and understand how Linktree works. So if you have no idea about Linktree and how to get started, then this video is for you. If you're someone who uses multiple social media platforms and wants to simplify your online presence, then you've come to the right place. Linktree is a tool that helps you to manage multiple links and present them all in one place, making it easier for your followers to access your content. In this tutorial, we'll guide you step by step on how to use Linktree. Just before we start, please consider giving me a thumbs up. Otherwise, I'll go right ahead and jump into the Linktree tutorial. First thing you first thing that you want to do is if you didn't create your account yet, you will have a link down below in the description. It's very easy to create an account. You'll start by adding your username. This is going to be your link, so be sure to add your business name or your brand name. Then, your email and password. Verify your email. And here we are in my Linktree account. When you're on the dashboard here, you'll see four tabs. Links, Appearance, Analytics, and Settings. These tabs will allow you to manage your links customize the appearance of your Linktree page, view analytics about your page's performance, and make account level setting changes. To begin adding links to your Linktree page, click on the Links tab. Here you'll see a list of all the links you've already added, as well as an option to add new links. To add a new link, click on the plus Add Link button. Once you click on Add Link, you'll be presented with two options. The first option is to enter the URL of the link you want to add in the URL box and click on Add. This will create a card where you can fill in the relevant title and URL for that link. The second option is to click on View All under the URL box. This will give you a list of various link options based on content, such as store or video links. Choose the option that best fits your needs and fill in the relevant information. Once you've added all of your links, you can begin to customize them. At the bottom of each link card, you'll see icons for redirect, thumbnail, prioritize, schedule, lock, and clicks. These icons allow you to make card-specific edits. If you have a free account, you can use the redirect icon upload your own tile thumbnail, and view the number of times your tile has been clicked. With a paid account, you can take all of these actions and more, such as highlighting specific links as priority links, scheduling when certain links go live, and accessing more in-depth analytics. To rearrange your links, simply drag and drop them into the order you want. In the Appearance tab, you can customize the appearance of your Linktree page. Here you can change the background image or color, select a font, and color scheme, and customize the design of your links. Once you are on the Appearance tab, here you will see a profile window. In the profile window, you can insert relevant information to the links you're offering, including a profile title, a brief bio, and a business-relevant image. This could be a logo for your business or personal brand. You can also add a social icon. To add a social icon, click on plus add social icons, and you will be taken to another page. Here, click on add icon to add your social icons such as Amazon, Etsy, email, Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn, etc. In the themes tab, select a Linktree theme that matches your preferences. You can choose from a variety of themes that suit your preferences. If you have a paid account, you can design your own theme, edit background colors, button shapes, and fonts, and even hide the Linktree logo. If you navigate down all the way to the bottom of the page, you'll see the option to hide the Linktree logo. At the bottom of your profile, your visitors will always see the Linktree logo. You'll need to upgrade to a paid plan to remove this logo, so let's take a look at the different available pricing plans. Linktree offers four different plans that are free. Starter, Pro and Premium. The free plan is 
as the name suggests, completely free of charge. The starter plan costs $5 per month. The pro plan costs $9 per month, and the premium plan costs $24 per month. Each of these plans comes with different features and benefits. We're going to focus on Linktree's free forever plan only in this Linktree tutorial. The Analytics tab provides you with detailed data and insights about how your Linktree page is performing. The Analytics tab displays three important metrics, Views, Clicks, and Click-Through Rate, CTR. The Views metric shows the total number of times your Linktree page has been viewed over a selected time period. This metric helps you understand how many people have seen your Linktree page. The Click metric shows the total number of times a link on your Linktree page has been clicked over a selected time period. This metric helps you understand which links are performing well and which ones need improvement. Click-through rate, CTR, is the percentage of clicks a specific link received compared to the number of views of that link. You can use this metric to evaluate the effectiveness of each link and optimize your Linktree page for better performance. By analyzing these metrics, you can understand your audience's behavior, optimize your Linktree page for better performance, and make data-driven decisions to grow your business. The Setting tab in Linktree is where you can manage various settings for your account. Under the Settings tab in the top left header, you can further edit your Linktree and add support banners, e-commerce integrations, and social media icons to link to your other social profiles. If you have a paid account, you will have additional features, such as the ability to add mailing list integrations for email or SMS. Now, if you want to add your Linktree page to your social profiles, it's a quick and easy process. First, navigate to the Share button within your Linktree dashboard. From there, select the Add Linktree to your Socials button in the Share drop-down menu. This will allow you to add your Linktree URL to your various social profiles, making it easy for others to find and access your Linktree. When you click on your desired social profile to add to the Linktree URL, you'll have two options to choose from. In my case, I want to link my Linktree URL to my Instagram account. The first option is to copy the Linktree URL and manually add it to your Instagram profile by clicking on Edit Profile and pasting the link into the website field. The second option is to click Go to My Instagram to be taken directly to your Instagram profile where you can add the Linktree URL. And there you have it, a beginner's guide to using Linktree. You can check the links in the description, that helps a lot, thank you. So again, if you found this video helpful, please give me a thumbs up and if you have any questions at all, please comment below. I try to answer all the comments the best I can. Thanks for watching and take care!